There are many times in a lizard's life when they may need to be force-fed. There are situations and conditions which will result in a lizard not eating on their own. Some diseases lizards can get will result in seizures, or a similar condition. It is imperative not to feed them during an incident like this. They will most likely not be able to swallow the food. It is best to seek the help of a veterinarian at this point. The animal will need to have a tube placed into their stomach to feed. If the animal shows no signs of seizures, they can be fed using a syringe. It is tricky to get their mouth open, but should be possible using the syringe itself. Using the syringe, squeeze the processed food into the back of the throat, taking great care to avoid the trachea at the back of the tongue. Make sure to only offer as much food as the animal can handle. Larger lizards can obviously handle more food. It may also be possible to force feed feeder insects. If the lizard is having digestive problems, the liquid substitute is much easier to digest, as much of the work is already done. Another advantage of liquid feeding is the fact that you control exactly what the lizard is getting into its diet. For the vegetable part of the liquid diet, vegetable baby food works very well. This food is high in vitamins and can easily be digested by the lizard. Younger lizards need to be fed more often but in smaller quantities, while larger lizards will need to be fed less often, but with higher quantities per feeding. You have to follow the natural way your lizard eats its food, as not to upset their natural metabolism. For more information and references, check the article on our website, website, http colon slash slash www.gigglingpausandpets.com Visit and follow us on our social media pages, Facebook, https colon slash slash www.facebook.com slash gigpospets slash twitter, https colon slash slash twitter.com slash gigglingpausin1 Instagram, https colon slash slash www.instagram.com slash gigglingpawsandpets slash disclaimer, the materials and the information contained on Giggling Paws and Pets channel are provided for general and educational purposes only and do not constitute any legal, medical or other professional advice on any subject matter. This presentation contains images that were used under a Creative Commons license. Visit the link below to see the full list of images and attributions, https colon slash slash link dot attribute dot to slash cc slash 353880.